suppose, and be supposed to, are used very often in English. Do not confuse them. The structures and meanings are not the same. Suppose is a verb has a number of different meanings and uses. Suppose can mean to think that something is true or probable. For example, I suppose he is telling the truth. This situation will continue, I suppose. I don't suppose he will let you buy him dinner. I supposed him to be married. It is also used in short answers, to refer back to something that has already been mentioned. Do you think we will make it in time? I suppose so. Shall we go to the party? I suppose. Will Jeremy attend the conference? I don't suppose so, or I suppose not. If the answer is negative, both structures are possible here. Suppose is also used when you agree to something with reluctance. Can I use your bike? I suppose so. Suppose is used in making polite requests. In this sense, we are not sure that we will get a positive answer. I don't suppose, you could lend me your car this evening. The sentence means, could you lend me your car this evening? I don't suppose, you could give some advice on it, could you? I don't suppose, I could have a look at the photo. This structure is negative. Suppose or supposing can also be used as a conjunction, when we are asking about the consequences of an imagined situation. Suppose or supposing plus present simple. Supposing there is no money left, what will we do then? The speaker believes this situation is likely to happen. Suppose or supposing plus past simple. Suppose you won the lottery, would you stop working? Past simple shows the future possibility, and speaker thinks this situation is unlikely to happen. Suppose or supposing plus past perfect. Suppose no one had been there. This situation was possible in the past, but it didn't happen. What if is also used, instead of suppose or supposing to imagine possible situations. Be supposed to. Be supposed to is different from suppose. The structure, be supposed to, plus, infinitive, is used to say what someone should do, according to a law, rule or custom. It refers to what is expected or required. I explain what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to be ready for class. Are we supposed to carry ID at all times? The flight was supposed to leave at 6. You were supposed to be here two hours ago. In the past, be supposed to refers to things that didn't happen for some reason.
the expression be supposed to refers to what is believed to be true by many people. For example, he is supposed to be the best player in the team. The sentence means that many people believe that he's the best player in the team. The prison was supposed to be haunted. This spray is supposed to kill the weeds. The negative structure of be supposed to is used to say what is not allowed. You're not supposed to park here. You're not supposed to smoke in the building. Test your understanding. Question 1. Complete the sentence. Either could be used here. Suppose or supposing it rains, what shall we do? Question 2. No, and do you? I don't suppose, you know her address or phone number, do you? Question 3. Complete the dialogue. Do you really think they'll win? I don't suppose so. Question 4. Each of these options could be used here. Question 5. I don't suppose. I don't suppose you can give me a lift into town, can you? Question 6. Supposed. I was supposed to post the letter. I forgot. Question 7. To be washing. He's supposed to be washing the car. Why is he watching TV? Question 8. He is supposed to be one of the best lawyers in town. What does this sentence mean? Many people say that he's one of the best lawyers in town. Question 9. Which sentence is correct? What time is the train supposed to arrive? Question 10. Which sentence contains a mistake?
character, is missing from the expression.